Hey everyone, I finally got something done. Uh, that is Paul's J4 Magneto for his Farmall Cub. It doesn't have the coil to rotor, I guess is what you can call it, wire, so I haven't had a way to test it. He's going to get some new plug wires anyways for it, so he's going to pick one up. Um, you can see I left it raw, um, and it's kind of shiny now. I really wished I had a buffing wheel to really put a mirror polish on these. Um, and I could easily find one to uh, put on my grinder. Take the other wheel off. But, alas, you know, i kind of got more important things to spend my money on right now. Cat. Anyways. She never wants to be around you until you try to do something. So this one got rebuilt, and it's got new gaskets in it. Um, I cleaned it up. This cap was painted red. I stripped it down and painted it black. Um, everything else in it was good. It's been lubricated. I got a new condenser in it. The points were sanded down because they were still good. They were just sanded, sanded down and checked. Uh, but they were in good shape. New coil condenser. Um, all that, yeah. So that'll hopefully be a good magneto for him. This one was mine. This is my own personal magneto for my tractor. That Wyco C. I have, I think I have another Wyco C on the way. We'll see. Um, lady wants a pretty, pretty darn cheap price for one that needs rebuilt. So we can see this one's not perfect. Um, you know, with the light shining on it, you can kind of see some of the imperfections in the plastic there. Especially on this side. Get the light back on it here. Here we go. And that's okay, you know. I was just trying to get this looking a little better. You guys can look at my other videos and see this on the tractor. And it looks kind of grungy. So what I did to clean it up is I, I disassembled it. Um, I left the coil and um, all that in there, but the condenser and all that comes out with that big cap took all that out i wire wheeled the case on it the aluminum case and uh and then i lightly wire wheeled the uh, caps just to kind of get the crud off of them um and i just painted them i stuck a couple old plug wires that i had into the holes and then i painted them with some uh gloss black paint turned out real nice I think the uh, paint that I use uh, makes it turn out real good it goes on real evenly has a nice shine to it um, and this one got new gaskets too I had sent this up before I was comfortable digging into a Wyco C I sent this up to a friend of mine's brother up in Kansas City and he put a new uh, spring in it for me and uh darn cat um so that spring really helped it start in that one video i have of it running and uh noticed on it too that the magnets are pretty weak and i explained that in another video about the magnet composition on these being um different than some of the later ones so they don't hold their magnetism as well <laughs> Uh, but I'm going to try running it like it is for now because I don't have a charger, but I do have plans to build one as well as a proper magneto tester. Um, so, yeah. I'm looking forward to getting this put back on the tractor. And well, I'm going to get my carburetor done, getting this retimed, and uh, get my tractor running again. So, anyways, that's what I've been up to. Um, Whenever I get some more carburetor stuff done, I'll show you guys. Cat's being awful lovey this morning. Anyways, guys, so yeah, that is my Wyco C for my John Deere B and a J4 Magneto for a Cub. So, thanks, guys.